Apparently Gary's feeling okay. Mm -mm. Oh, whoops. Right. Oh, wait. Did, did the game start? Hold on. Okay. <laughs> Gary the Chonker. Gary the Chonker. Gary the, the Chungus. Okay. Time to figure out what's on this thing. Okay, okay. Okay. Oh, I like the cursor. Wait, I can't do I can't do new game, I can only do continue. Here? Another challenger. It has been ages. Perhaps you've forgotten how this game is played. Allow me to remind you. Play the scroll card. Now play your stoat. Oh, S. Okay. What if I play a different card? You are lacking sacrifices for that creature. Uh, oh, okay, play the stoke. Oh, so this takes one sacrifice. So to play the stoat, we have to kill the squirrel? An honorable death, play the stoat. Bulls require two sacrifices. You don't have enough. Ring the bell to end your turn and commence combat. Your stoat stands unopposed. The number on the bottom left is your attack power. Stoat dealt me one damage. I added it to the scale. You win if you tip my side all the way down. Like this. My turn. Your stoat stands in the way of my coyote. My coyote dealt two damage to your stoat. It means your stoat's health is two less. If a creature's health reaches zero, it dies. It's your turn again. You may draw from your deck, or you may draw a squirrel. Uh oh. Okay. How reckless of you. Oh, I should have drawn the squirrel and then sacrificed them both for a wolf. I've made a huge mistake. Because you are learning, I will pass. How nice of you. You've drawn all the creatures from your deck. A squirrel is your only choice. Cool. You dealt one damage, so I put one weight on the scale. You know you can play more than one card per turn, right? Of, of course I did. You're not the beast is sacrificed but not removed from your deck its suffering was real but you will see it again oh. you've won this match it won't all be so easy let me recall your story oh yeah You were lost deep in the forest. A single path revealed itself. 
Two denizens of the forest approached you tentatively. The caustic adder. Damage from its poison bite is always lethal. The undying cat. Sacrificing the poor beast does not kill it. Only one may grace your paltry deck. should have gotten snack. Another creature joins your caravan. Some of the creatures of the forest seem willing to follow you. You came across an abandoned sack. And a squirrel in a bottle. Break in case of emergency. Have a second. Another useful implement. It will allow you to tip the scales with it is as much as you can carry. You were ambushed while crossing some rough terrain. You sacrificed me while I was sleeping. It was the right play. I get it. Maybe. You'll help me? Play along for now. You may now see my moves ahead of time. Okay. What's this do? Hard brain the sigil will grow into a more powerful form after one turn on the board. Okay, I can't hit it because there's nothing in front of it, I'm guessing. Um, putting the stone in. Here we go. this down or do I want to go for damage? Let's, let's put it here. Because he can't put an attacker there. And then I can use it to sacrifice something better. But I don't want to do that yet. I'm going to break this one. Put you down. And I'm going to put this down with these. Okay. Mind the ambitious wolf cub, it ages swiftly. Okay. Okay. I don't know if I should, should I kill him again? <laughs> I'm going to do it. Wow, seriously? <laughs> Sorry. Airborne bat flies over creatures to attack directly. Oh. Ah, my black bat flew right over your river snapper. Rude. Oh, look, it actually flies. That's cool. Okay. Hmm. Higher attack damage. Failed and trekked onwards past the now bloody terrain. The young wolf cub. It grows into a wolf after a single turn. The meek sparrow, an inexpensive, if feeble, flying creature. I guess we need this to defend against flying, right? Because it flies. We have no flying defense currently. You could also do a sparrow to hit over terrain, possibly? I already have two wolves. 
Oh, and a cat. Oh god, what is this? You stumbled into some strange stones in the mist. You were compelled to choose a worthy sacrifice, one that will be lost forever? Sorry, kitty. <laughs> you looked upon your menace and selected a healthy host? Pick me? <laughs> what an honor. A ghastly spectacle, but the soul of the cat now lives in the stoat. my totem. It, ex it describes my canine cards with the airborne sigil. Nutcase says, uh, when is going to be continued in October? Well, this is kind of nope tobery but pretty soon. Pretty soon, Nutcase. Um, is it just me or is Ko's voice bugging out when he is talking and gamer sounds get compressed? Cat, is anyone having mic sounds this morning? Mic issues? That's weird. No? Oh, oh, you know what? Check, check uh, low latency on your side. Maybe that's the problem. Okay. <laughs> He's completely insane. You see that, right? No care for the rules. Pathetic, really. Enough. Only keeps me around to watch me suffer. Why does this happen? You are lacking sacrifices for that stope, but you do have a squirrel. No, that's not what I meant. Uh, what are we doing over here? Flying bat or a coyote. They both fly. You can't do anything about that. Back on the board. Underscore. What does this do? Oh, he has many lives. Okay, cool. What does this do? To the user, you will place a weight on the scale. The pain is temporary. I don't think I want to use that yet. My totem is granted my coyote the power of flight. What the hell, dude? This dude's cheating. Oh, wait, what does this do? Oh, wait, what am I? Ow! Oh. A well earned point of damage. I, don't, I didn't think you'd really do it. Ow! Four damage away from winning. Um. Are you gonna kill him? Maybe. Let's find out. We got him. Nice. Impressive. You may yet survive this ordeal. Knock on wood. Watchful bullfrog. It leaps in the way of attacking flyers. Oh, flying defense. Okay. Reviled skunk. Its stench reduces the strength of the enemy. Defense card with zero attack. And another wolf. What is this? Is that a mushroom? <laughs> what is what is this? Hey, Divine Digital, how are you, bud? Hey, Darfox John. Sorry I'm late. I have major pl plumbing problems at my house. Oh, dude. You should get Zeke? Oh, the skunk? Um. Get the bullfrog. What's a campfire do?
came across a small group of survivors. Faces shrunken from starvation, they huddled around a campfire. They looked upon your group of creatures and beckoned. Um, warm one of your creatures by the fire, one said. Warming it by the fire, that will enhance its power, said another. You notice one of the survivors wiping drool from their mouth. Wait a second. Fire warmed the poor river sapper, enhancing its power. One of the survivors reached towards it. Another gnashed their teeth. Without a word, you pulled the river snapper away from the fire and left. Oh, wow. I totally thought we were going to lose that card or something. Okay. Oh, man. What do we got coming down? Whoa! Wish I had that skunk right now. A sparrow. Okay. can sparrow the sparrow, I guess, but dude, that guy's gonna hurt. Okay. I can't sacrifice the trees, can I? No. Another grizzly? Uh... Hmm. Thank you, Divine Digital, with the five gift bomb and a pool of three. Hey, Co, just moved to Greensboro for a new job. Love it here so far. Dude, I loved NC. It, it was, it was a, yeah, NC is great. NC is great. Thank you so much for the 62 and Divine Digital with the five gift bomb. Long goes to you. Hey, Mr. Fluffy Snoozer. Welcome to the channel, buddy. And yes, F to pay respects for my loss. Absolutely. Um, okay. So I could... I could sacrifice the sparrow and a squirrel to put a wolf here and take a hit instead of one, but how much life is there left? What does this do? Oh, it's my turn. I think I'm going to do that, which is going to leave us open on the left side with the sparrow, but I mean, I think this would kill us otherwise. Oof. Oh, I lost anyway. You've lost. Using this as use using this as a learning opportunity may be the only way to mitigate my disappointment. Get up. Get up from the table. Touch the candlestick from atop the barrel beside the door. This is kind of awesome. Bring it here. Now sit back down. It's a picture of the table. What are these? Let me explain something to you. That was one of the two mistakes you can make here. If you make another, I must sacrifice you. Now, where were we? Oh. <laughs> Fatal Paradox, welcome to the community, buddy. How are you? The flighty elk, it moves after attacking. I guess this means we already have the card. A little mushroom. Got 
dust from this may lift your creatures into the air if only for a turn. A rock may get you out of a hard place. Choose one. Overburdened enough for the full three items you carried on. Oh, dude. Kev McScotland with the 80 months! Oh my god, look at this. The trees seemed to close in around you as a chill mist descended. In the distance, you could hear the clinking of metal on stone. Hobbled figures stood in your path. Hee haw, twas the prospector. <laughs> Hee haw! Yeah. <laughs> He's doing the prospector again? Easy boss. The mule is key. So we gotta kill the mule. Spot? You sure? No. Not anymore. Um. Space would be struck, a card during the sigil will move to that space to receive the strike instead. Interesting. I neglect to mention overkill damage. Excess damage is not wasted carries over the card behind the mangled corpse of the victim. Lucky for you. didn't think it would be that easy. Oh, damn. Okay. Um. The, there's gold in them cards. <laughs> Get near it. Oh! What the Sam here's this? Gold. I struck gold. What the shit? Wait a second. What is this? Can I sacrifice that? How, I don't, what? <laughs> what is this? I, I just have to wait? Get him! Oh, rude. Uh, I can't play anything. Porcupine view. Once a car brain, this will struck. The striker is dealt a single point of damage. Okay. This sucks. This is gonna kill him, but it'll take him down to one, I guess. What's this do? Thorny rebuke. Okay. Um. I need another spot. I 
could put, I could just put a scroll down to eat a hit. I can do the bullfrog to, I think it would kill him? Would that kill him? I think it would. Because it attacks first, right? Yeah. Okay. So now I need to put a card down here to attack him so he will die before he lethals somebody. Cat is zero, though. I could sacrifice the bullfrog. I think we're going to do that. And it may be kind of a waste, but... This will kill the bullfrog. Or the adder. Okay. Cool. Uh, let's get... We could bring the cat into play. I guess we can do that now. But I feel kind of bad wasting a spot here. to wait for that to go through. I guess I have to draw a card. We got him. Allow me to light your candles once more. I won't be killing you quite yet. Okay. You're the first in a while to overcome a boss. As a reward, you are granted an opportunity to select a rare card. Okay, um, oh lord, the dreaded what do you want from the grocery store, um, applause please, um, uh, chat, what do I want from the grocery store, I don't, I got, dude, I got plenty of alcohol, I don't need beer anymore, oh, donuts, that's a good one, ice cream and strawberries, that's a good one, oh, 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 grill stuff, because I'm going to grill this week, yeah, um, brownies, candy, that's too, that's, too, that's way too, pretzels? Pretzels are good. Pretzels. Thank you, chat. I don't know what I'd do without you sometimes. I think it's good. I think we're good. Okay. Great. Oh, yeah. Great. Okay. Choose carefully. The uninspiring geck. Perhaps you can find a use for it. What is, is that? Is that the type of card in the top left? No. What does that mean up there? Why does that look like a dragon? Whoa. A 7-7? Seven, seven? Strange larva. But carbon decision will grow into a more powerful form after a turn. And it only cost one and has three defense. Oh, this, we don't need anything to, pl uh, we don't need to sacrifice something for a Gek, though, and it can attack. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, okay. <clears throat> um. Mm-mm. This is tough. These are all good, but I feel like I feel like these are probably going to be more used by far. This is like an end game thing. By the time we get to this, we're probably either already winning or going to lose. I'm going to do the get. Let's do the get. Seven seven seems like a trap. I agree. I agree. Now wait a second. Now that I understand how this works a little bit, what is? Hold on. I, have, I didn't actually look at the numbers. What's mine? Ah, oh, yeah, that's right. Ooh. <laughs> nine, nine. Nice. And I only want, I only cost one? Oh, dude. Awesome. Okay. I'm a beast. Let's go. All right. Why not six, nine? Oh. With the sound of the prospector's pickaxe still ringing in your ears, you carried onwards. 